Good morning, Taylor and Lindsay. That's right, Olathe educators are teaching students how to do their jobs. It's one of their few, it's called their Future Ed Educator Academy, and teachers are in high demand all over, so to keep students in the district they grew up in, Olathe schools are offering them jobs for when they graduate college. I talked to a teacher and a teacher in the making about how this program works. When I was really little, like I would always make my sisters play school, like just for fun. Jaya Storm is a senior and a teacher in the making, one who was just offered her dream job. They told me that they were offering me the contract and I was like, Oh my gosh, I got it. I was so relieved. Olathe Public Schools runs a Future Educators Academy. Shelly Staples leads the program. We are a four-year preparation program for teachers, job shadowing and seeing what it's like actually in the trenches of being a teacher. The students shadow at all types of schools. Senior Caitlin Pedigo found her passion in one she hardly knew existed. I kind of got to go somewhere that I know like a lot of people don't actually know about. Um, again, working with individuals that have disabilities. Jaya Storm picked one close to home. I picked my old elementary school and I got to go back to the teacher that made me want to be a teacher. Anna Persaud had a similar story. My third grade teacher, because I like had really been struggling with math and she always found like a new way. Math turned into something more fun. Well, I would like to be that for someone someday. Someday is soon for these students. Through the Future Educators Academy, they signed job promises for after they graduate college. Students give four years of their lives to me in our program, and so how do we validate their experiences and show like, hey, we think you are gonna be a candidate and you're gonna be a wonderful teacher. They say you should never meet your heroes. They don't just teach like curriculum and stuff, they teach like how to be a good person and how to treat people with respect. But they don't say anything about working with them. I have a lot of mentors that I look up to and teachers in the district, and I think it'd be really cool to be able to come back and work with them. And they're the people I want to have as my coworkers. That's what Teacher Appreciation Week is about, like recognizing that this teacher is doing the best they can to help all of these students. They call the program Hire Our Own, and this year they have college student teachers in Olathe classrooms that were part of the program a few years ago, and Staples tells me that they look forward to having these teachers in full-time classrooms soon and filling some much-needed teacher openings. Taylor and Lindsay. So let's talk about interest in this, Olivia. How many seniors are saying, yes, I want to do this, and are they all at Olathe East? Yes, so this year they had eight out of eight seniors apply and get jobs. They signed their contracts while I was shooting the story. It was a really happy day for them. Aww. And so what they do is they're from all over the district, okay. all of all high schools in the district, and they attend all classes at Olathe East, but they get to do sports and extracurriculars back at their home high school to yeah. still keep those connections with maybe friends from their middle school and elementary school. That's really cool because you never know where they might end up once they come back and get those teachers teaching jobs in the district. Olivia, thank you so much.